Alright, ladies and gentlemen, for today, I'm going to try and do a... I don't even know what you call it. You basically fill the cup, flip it, like you do a flip pour, and then you want to not break that meniscus. You don't want to let it pour out. You want to let it, like, roll out. And it produces a very interesting wave-like effect that I... Added a little bit of oil there. And as always, you see that ribbon of paint? This one's actually a little thick. I could stand to add more flow trouble to this, but I hate this color, so I probably won't. This is just so it flows better because I haven't had good luck with these. And this is just kills and flow troll. And you want to give it a little bit of time to mix in there, okay? But, now, see how it's running out around the edges? So you see how it's already waving around? You actually have to squeeze the cup a little as you lift it so it doesn't create a vacuum. And then you can kind of blow it from inside the cup. And the bubble popped, this goes. You see where the bubble popped right there? And as long as I have a filthy spatula, I might as well use my filthy spatula. And right now I'm just letting it bloom out because the whole point is that shock wave going outwards. So this one, like how I smeared paint on it to begin with, you really want it to flow out from the center. So you definitely can't tilt this one very much at all, is a big part of the issue with this. And you can see this edge will be fine, this edge will be fine. I need to get it out there and out there. So, we're going to see what happens if I pull it with that. And this is cheating, but you should really use like a circular piece for this, in all honesty. Okay. That's good. You see that edge is going to roll right off, that edge is pretty close, this edge could be filled in a little, but that's fine. That edge needs it the most. We're going to go that way. And I'm trying to keep this circle in the middle. And 
I'm letting it even out again. And this side's going, that side's mostly good. I can't really get all of this, it's not going to be perfect. And that heat also helps the paint flow a little bit, so I hope it looks anything like what it was supposed to look like. I'll probably try another one in a little bit here. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe.